<laughs> we have had issues in this school for the past uh, one week where the senior principal, Madam Christine Sifuna, has been transferred and uh, uh, Violet Oyungo Ambio allegedly being transferred to this school from where uh, she previously served. We want to state categorically that we have not been fully involved in the changes that are happening now. We are leaders from this region, I'm the area MP, and uh, uh, this school is one of my, uh, my uh, good schools within Sabatia constituency. As an elected representative of the people, I have a duty to defend uh, what rightfully belongs to us, and I have the duty to defend the school from interference from people who are purporting to be uh, uh, helping us when they are destroying. But TSC, under the leadership of Madame Lois, thinks that we are fools, that she is questioning our integrity. We will see. To sit exams. Other classes are equally in the middle of their, of their curriculum coverage. If transition is to happen in the middle of the year, as it is, and especially with that, the kind of theatrics and drama and disharmony that is associated with the change of God at this school, parents are apprehensive. Where is the safety of our learners? And most importantly, how safe is the progression of the academic programs that have been initiated in this school? Where are we going, at what stage are we going then to recover the time that is going to be lost with the kind of drama that will happen just because uh, the sponsor is uncomfortable with our principal coming to take over from the one that is leaving. We want an accommodative administrator. We want an administrator that will create an environment that will be conducive for learning. We are keen as parents to have an administrator that will take at her heart the issues about the prosperity and the future, the destiny of our daughters. We would not sit back as parents to see the future of our children, and especially in the middle of the year of an academic calendar being tampered with. That is not called for, and we pray that the Teacher Service Commission, which is the appointing and, and uh, the authority that is vested with the permission, with the ability to transfer teachers, to get us an alternative teacher if the sponsor is uncomfortable. And so we join the board in taking the position that has been identified as the true direction, as the sponsor has indicated. Today is 20, 2023. Why Kebeye girls? We have so many scoops. We, as a Quaker church, we would kindly ask the TSC to move her elsewhere and we get a neutral person to take over the school. I've been a board member of this school. This is now my second term. And we've worked towards bringing this school to where it is currently. And we've had, uh, we've had a lot of concern where, when it comes to academics. So our interest, even in ple pleading with the ministry and the TSC, to ensure that there is smooth continuation and uh, the welfare of this uh, school, is to have an administrator who will actually bring this school, maintain the standards of this school. And as our standards are very loud, you can even read it uh, from the news, we have always had many students from this school going to the university. So our, our plea as the board is to ensure that there is this continuation of these academics standards of this school maintained. We are not uh, against this principle. We are wondering, after all this time, she is being recycled back to Kebele Gaps. And the Kebele Girls is one of the institutions in Kenya. This lady is one of the uh, teach principals in Kenya. Why is she being recycled back? And me, as a trustee, I take care of the properties of Quaker schools at Chavakaliya Limited.
is, it raises a lot of concern. This is why we are here as sponsors together with the Board of Management, Kenya Girls, to raise our issues. And we hope our issues will be... We are not against this teacher, but those question marks. Why? Why is she being recycled? Is she wanting also this board to resign, the second board to resign? She had been in the Kaimos girls, and the, uh, standards. And the standards. And you know, Kebeye started uh, later than Kaimos, but eventually Kebeye went, and uh, when we were measuring the mean score, Kebeye was far ahead. So we said now, we could not have her here. Standards, standards, standards. And even in body management meetings, we discuss standards first before we start. We discuss anything else. Standards, standards, standards. And I'm impressed as a, as a trustee, this board of management has kept standards. Oh. Oh, oh. Hmm. You need to switch off. Yeah, I'll just. How can it? Oh, oh.